Beloved ones, we are the Arcturians. We are here to leave with you another morning message. When we say morning, we don't mean so much the time of day. We mean that to which you are awakening. For our dear volunteers wearing human vessels, you are beginning to awaken to a very beautiful, wonderful, and so long-awaited moment of the now. However, this now can only be perceived from a higher state of consciousness and from a higher perspective of reality. While you are still bound to your ego state of consciousness and to the duties and chores of your mundane life, you will miss that which is occurring all around you. So therefore, this morning, we wish to assist you to expand your consciousness so that you can expand your perception. We ask you now to take a long, slow, deep breath and breathe in the newness of this day. Evening, afternoon, time is an illusion of the third dimension. And as you breathe in, hold that which you have known as the truth. Hold that which you have perceived as reality. And as you breathe out slowly and calmly, release, release the illusions of the third, fourth dimension. Release the lies and propagandas that you have been told. Release that which of you have thought was once so very important. And now, just move into the quiet. Move into that which is beginning. And that which is beginning is that you are returning to your higher dimension of self. Yes, all of you are doing so. Whether or not you are able to pinpoint that moment of transition with your consciousness is not important in the scheme of what is occurring in your reality. So just know that even if you are temporarily not available to experience this now, eventually you will. You will be ready. You will be available. So here is the rehearsal. And this rehearsal, which is of course reality, we ask you to take a long, slow breath and breathe in your higher expression. Feel that moment of peace, of clarity, of alignment, of joy, and of unconditional love that every now and again flows into your awareness. Now we want to remind you that that every now and again is the every now and again that you have been calibrated to consciously perceive this event that is constantly occurring within the now. However, while you are trapped in time, and third dimensional distractions, you may not be able to connect your third dimensional thinking with your multi-dimensional mind. But what we are sharing with you is constantly and eternally occurring. You cannot miss a moment of it, for it is all stored within your multi-dimensional mind. And when you are ready, when your consciousness is still and calm, and when you can release all aspects of fear,
and focus on unconditional love, you will be in alignment with this higher dimensional expression of yourself. Now within this now, imagine your multidimensional mind is a huge matrix and within this matrix is only unconditional love and the truth of the one for it resonates to that frequency. Therefore, only messages, experiences, and beings that resonate to unconditional love and multidimensional truth are able to adhere to this library, your personal connection to your multidimensional self. Within this now, we ask that you just turn around inside yourself, for you don't have to seek up to find your higher expression. Oh no, your higher expression is right there within you, within your core. And as you turn and look into your core, oh, there it is. Oh, you feel it, don't you? You feel that wavering, that resonance of unity, resonance of unconditional love. That is your higher dimensional self. And so we ask that you just slip into that feeling. Allow that feeling to engulf you, to encompass you. Feel it over, under, around, and through you. And from that state of consciousness, look out into your third dimensional world. And when you look out into your third dimensional world, through this state of consciousness, it appears quite differently. For you can see all the myriad thought forms of hope and love and light that are floating throughout your world. You can also perceive every now and again a thought form that is of a lower frequency. And what you do as you blaze, blaze, blaze it with violet fire, as you send it unconditional love and release it from your reality. So take a moment of this now. If there is anything, any person, any place, any situation, that is of a lower frequency. We ask you now that you surround it with violet fire, send it unconditional love, and merely love it free as you transmute it into its higher frequency of expression. And as you are now able to have this higher perspective of your self. Now we ask that you have this higher perspective of your group. By your group, we mean the ones with whom you most often interact, the ones that you have aligned with. Many of these people might be very far away from you in terms of geographical alignment, thanks to the wonderful internet. But that does not matter. For now, within your higher expression of self, you speak consciousness to consciousness. So the grounded version of the physical self to whom you speak can be anywhere on the physical reality. In fact, anywhere in the fourth dimensional reality and anywhere in the fifth dimensional and beyond realities. For you are in connection with your multidimensional mind. From your multidimensional mind, 
Now look into your beloved planet and look into the body of Gaia and see all the areas of Gaia that need your unconditional love and violet fire and engulf those areas with the violet fire send them unconditional love and blaze, blaze, blaze that violet fire as you transmute, dear Gaia, back into the transpersonal, transplanetary being that she has always been. Now feel your transpersonal, transplanetary being that you have always been. And feel the versions of yourself that are not restricted to the illusion of third dimensional earth. And feel those versions of yourself that are perhaps on a starship, that are perhaps on a higher dimensional planet, that are perhaps angelic or galactic. In fact, angelic and galactic. For as you perceive these higher frequencies of yourself, there is no longer that separation of individuality. Feel how all of reality flows within great oneness. Feel that oneness within your own self. And as you feel that oneness within your own self, that becomes the lens through which you look out into all of reality, as well as in to all of reality. For reality is within all of you, and you project it out so that you can have the experience of visiting and interacting. And once you visit and interact, it becomes within. Now we ask your third dimensional brain to release the confusions of those statements and to merely surrender these concepts to your multidimensional mind. For with your multidimensional thinking, you are aware of all that is within the now.